I had a bunch of cardboard so I wanted to see if I could somehow use it to make stuff for my hamster. I wanted to try and make cardboard clay. I've seen people make paper clay before, but it always contains unsafe ingredients like salt, oil, baking soda, vinegar and so on. The first thing I did was rip up cardboard, leave it in hot water overnight and blend it in a blender. I added some water to blend it better. After it was all mushy, I removed the water using a strainer. I removed about 80% of the water only because I didn't want it to be too dry when adding the next ingredient. I made the cardboard into a bowl so it wouldn't dry out. This is how it looks like for now. Next I'm using cornstarch to hopefully help keep the pulp from breaking off. Many paper clay recipes use it so I wanted to try. Then I kneaded it all to blend it together. I added a bit non-toxic water-soluble glue, I will probably add a bit more next time. Then I kneaded it all to blend it together. I got a glass bowl to use as a mold. I worked from top to bottom, but I think working from bottom up would have been better because the clay was heavy and it did slide down a bit. I think putting the clay on the inside would have been easier for both shaping it and taking it off later, but I really liked the texture and wanted to keep it. I made the entrance right away instead of cutting it out later, which I think was a mistake and you'll see why later. I also wanted to make a little tunnel. I used a big plastic one as a mold to get the curve, but if you don't mind it being straight, you can use a bottle. I didn't want to put too much on the sides to make it easier to take off. This experiment is part of a bigger project I'm planning and that is to make a full cage setup with items made of cardboard only. I do have a lot of cardboard. This is how it looks like, I'm pretty happy with it. I had some leftover clay and decided to make a little heart dish. No idea what I will use it for. The hardest part of this project was waiting for things to dry. I was impatient with the tunnel, decided to take it off the mold too soon and broke it into pieces. I glued them together and I actually like how it turned out. I baked the house a bit to speed up the process which gave it this dark color for some reason. I'm happy with the texture as well, but after I removed the house from the mold, it was drying more and more and started changing shape. I think this was because I made the entrance right away instead of cutting it out later. Baking the cardboard clay definitely makes it harder. I think the DIYs could have been better, but are okay for first try.